and MailChimp lists are where I can go to actually view my email list. So you can see this jerrybanfield.com list. This is the original list I made. You can see the date it was created and you can see how many subscribers it still has on it along with the average open rate and the average click rate. Now I haven't focused very much on the list up until this point because the majority of the work in the front end for building a good email list is figuring out and setting up the method of delivering value to the list. I feel like in internet marketing and online advertising, we obsess so much about building that list, building that list. The list will stay healthy, build on its own momentum, and build very effectively on whatever efforts you make as long as you are doing a good job giving the people on that email list what they want. There's a reason people buy thousands of courses from me and enroll in courses, about 10,000 plus enrollments every month from my work on Udemy. It's because I'm. you can see I'm here with you now, honestly doing my best to give you real value, value that you can really get inspired by and use in what you're doing. In other words, my primary objective is to give to you because I know what I give to you will be received back. That means my primary objective is not to receive. It's not to get something out of you. The reason I'm doing this is to give to you. So on your email list, this is the place where the people you're giving to are all gathered together. This is a place where all the raw email addresses are kept and any other field you select. I recommend at least getting people's names because the biggest thing I've found that works really well is addressing and remembering people's names. Most of us are very attached to our names. So in MailChimp you can set up and in any others I'm sure you can set up all the fields you want to collect from people. So the list is where the actual people are kept. So when you put these three things together, campaigns are often created in templates that then send are used to send emails to the list. So you make the email in the template, you send it in the campaign to a specific list. So that's how all of this works together.